So by your admission in this, in this chamber, Mr. Hughes, you have received $56 million from the United States government for planes you never delivered. That is correct. Well, excuse me for asking, Mr. Hughes, but what, where did all that money go? Well, it went into the planes, Senator. And a lot more. What other larcenies did you commit? I mean, I put my money into the plane, Senator. My money. See, the thing is, Your I personal care. finances are, are not... Let him, let him speak. See, the thing is, I care very much about aviation. It has been the great joy of my life. That is why I put my own money into these planes and I've lost millions, Senator Brewster. And I'll go on losing millions. It's just what I do. Now, if I've lost a lot of the government's money, well, I hope folks will put that into perspective. You see, more than 60 other airplanes were ordered from such firms as Lockheed, Douglas, Northrop, and Bowen. Never saw action either. In all, over $800 million was spent on planes during the war that never flew. Over $6 billion in other weapons that were never delivered. Yet, Hughes Aircraft with her $56 million is the only firm here today under investigation. Now, I cannot help but think that has a little bit more to do with TWA than with planes that did not fly. Now, one more thing, Senator Brewster, one more thing I have to say to this committee. It has to do with the Hercules. Now, I'm supposed to be many things which are not complimentary. I'm supposed to be capricious. I have been called a playboy. I have even been called an eccentric, but I do not believe I have the reputation of being a liar. Now, needless to say, the Hercules was a monumental undertaking. It is the largest plane ever built. It is over five stories tall with a wingspan longer than a football field that's more than a city block. Now, I put the sweat of my life into this thing. I have my reputation all rolled up in it. And I've stated several times that if the Hercules fails to fly, I will leave this country and never come back. And I mean it. Now, Senator Brewster, you can't subpoena me. You can arrest me. You can even claim that I folded up and taken a run-out pattern. But, well, I had just about enough of this nonsense. Good afternoon.